now that I'm seeing it be put to use? Yes, the thing you never let go through, at which I have coined Plan Alpha Omega Zeta 3. This is why you let Alpha Omega. I even showed the guys that I was ran that were the random guys playing Alpha Good, Omega great. Zeta now Three. You pissed off the monk. Who cares? <laughs> don't fuck with the monk. Just don't bother with him. Pretty sure the monk doesn't care, honestly. No, he, he no, he's aggro. He's on the torn horn. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure he's. If he attacks, then fucking I'll be damned. But if he doesn't, don't fuck. All right, he's in the turn order, so I'm pretty sure he's going to attack. Sort of exploded him a little. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about him too much. Punching your buns. I worry more about the flesh golems. I can actually rip us apart. Yeah, I'm far more worried about that. Mr. Clawing. Deal with them, I'll deal with this guy. <laughs> Alright. Well, it just seems easier than making you waste AP to come over here for a guy that only needs, like, maybe one more hit. Also clears the fire. That's the best part about it. This meat golem's dead. What? Oh no, it has one HP left. It's just not down. Oh, the bleeding killed the meat golem. Healing damages me. That's what Decaying Touch does. Heal you, right, got it. <laughs> eh, I'd expect it. Can you fortify? He doesn't have it. I know, but you do it. Not my turn. It shouldn't I'll kill get me. So when I get to it. Holy shit, if you fucking live. Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, he doesn't have that many attacks. Holy crap! Anyways, I'm gonna... I take it I can rely on you to heal and I'll fortify, because... Yeah, I'll heal. Go poke this guy. Never mind. Can't fortify. Damn it. I think we really needed the fortify at that point. Yeah. Well, actually, no, never mind. This is the build. <laughs> Have fun spending AP. Oh, fucking love that. Have fun spending AP walking all the way over here. So you can't hit me 17 times. 
you just knock it off? Somehow he's on fire in the freaking blood rain. I don't get this. Blood rain doesn't put out fires. It doesn't make you wet. It does. It Literally right here. Friggin' blood rain. Makes you wet and has bleeding. Okay, never mind. I'm full of shit. Yes. As is your natural state. Step out. But also, yes. Rage gives him extra AP. I don't know why you... What, like, what did you cast before that? Was that Encourage or some shit? No, like, I all, all I know is you didn't... Prince. What? I healed the Prince. Why? He was mostly full health. Well, that's a res scroll down the drain. But why bother? He's... <laughs> yeah, I have four. Red scrolls? Yeah. That's weird, because we were kind of strapped for red scrolls on my run with the randoms. I don't know, I just found them. <laughs> oh, I guess we're done. Well, yeah, everybody Did died. died or... oh, everybody... Just... Yes, they all died. Oh, okay. Anyways, he has a battle. Not the meat golem. He has a resurrection scroll, a freaking gold, a meat golem cage key. Uh, daggers called chastity and abstinence. One that sets 10% chance for bleeding, and the other one that sets 10% chance for muted. But the problem is, is they operate on finesse. Uh. I don't know if I want to do this because I can't click on Lozy. I'll be clicking on the meat golem. But this battle worn sword can go to friggin' the Red Prince. I can't. Okay, there we go. I had to click on our picture. Well, you can't click on our corpse to find it. I couldn't click on our corpse because the meat golem is on top of it. Well, then you couldn't find it. Ooh, scale boots. <laughs> okay, and you can get the magic. save. That fight is the most dicey of all of them because he just literally does so much damage. Ooh, leg. Ooh, leg. I'm pretty sure the leg does the same... the one leg does the same thing as the other one, which is give fortify. Ooh, unidentified flesh. Bloody Rose? Uh, keep the bloody rose. Okay. Do we have a potion vial while we're at it? Yeah, we do. Yeah, I do. Uh, combine the bloody rose with the empty potion bottle. Oh, blood rose elixir. What's that do? It's really good. Plus one everything. 
permanent. Permanent boost? I'm drinking this. I imagine you would. Cool. It's basically a... It's a lot of free levels since you only get one of those uh, attribute points per level. I should have used the axe. Poke. What the fuck? You're seriously not gonna use the spear of Brockus? Oh, this is better. Not in terms of frickin' petrifying. Which basically says you're not gonna do anything for a turn. I look so. Give me the Spear of Brockus or you're not going to use it. Alright, fine. You're going to have the Spear of Brockus. Four magic armor. Give me that shit. Okay, so I've basically found a complete set of gear for me and my uh, mage friend. My witch friend, rather. Hold on, let me get within poking distance. We all back away anyway. Where the fuck do you think you're going? I don't know how the hell freezing touch went through my magic armor. Go get her. We attacked her or whatever. Okay, so we don't have to deal with the dogs. Oh, are we? I think we're done here. Uh, t -t 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 the only place left is upstairs, and I don't think we want to fuck with that. Oh, there's no, the two monks in the hallway will probably piss the dog off. Uh, the front gate is one area where we have to venture. Oh boy. Not the courtyard. It's. That is the front gate. Now we need to go downstairs. Well, we need to go at the front gate from the front. Uh oh. Alright. Oh. In the party that I was with, we had this elf that used Brockus' spear and petrified like every fucking time. And he kept on... By the way, the consuming constitution thing, it doesn't do that every time. Like, it, it consumes constitution, but only for the fight. Okay, now it says 1 AP and 25% damage boost at the cost of 4 constitution. Ah, so they nerfed it. Good. Try and do the 7. Is it constitution how much damage you can take? That's your health. Yeah, so I don't recommend using it now because now it's nerfed. It was one constitution. 
Yeah. 